everybody what's going on so today we got some more stuff so this is the reshoot episode so we screwed up the i screwed up the last episode I screwed yeah, up the camera did. forgot to change the 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 settings on it so now we're good i think and so we got That's more so. stuff um so what this episode is this episode is some uh through the mail autographs uh, the band box returned that when we did the band box video, was missing the autograph, so they did get back to us. Um, we'll do that one first. And also, then we have the uh, autograph of the month. So right. Let's do the yeah. uh, band box. So the band box, here is the autograph. This is autograph by Martin Casella. So this is the Poltergeist one. Um, this, I might have this up for trade on one of the uh, band box websites. Just because I don't really watch that too much, but I knew they were like Bandbox was gonna contact me and get me the stuff. They sent this and they sent me the Nakatomi uh, Tower Plaza badge that didn't come in the other box, so we got both of them back. Um, but yeah, um, I might trade it for, for a previous Bandbox autograph, but I'm really happy they did send it. So yeah. I, I knew they were gonna send it, it just sucks when you open something, you do a video. And the whole it's, reason why someone came to watch the video was the autograph. <laughs> it was the autograph, and it's not there. So yeah, it's a bummer. Um, yep. Now I'm gonna move on to the autograph of the month club. Uh, last time we did it, I wasn't a huge fan of the autograph just because I didn't really know who she was. But this month, completely different. Friggin' super awesome autograph. I wish the footage was better because that was like an, it was like a legit reaction. But yeah, we got this. He is the bad guy from Thor of the Dark World. His name's Christopher Excelliston. I'll br <laughs> brutalize that. But this one is really, really cool. I think it's awesome, especially if you're paying 25 bucks and it's the autograph you get, one of the villains from a Marvel movie. That's pretty wild. So yep. um, that one, I, this one I'm going to keep. Definitely going to hang it somewhere. Super cool. I don't have many Marvel autographs just because they're so hard to get. Like, I saw... Uh, uh, Chris Hamlet or what's the name? Uh, not, oh, I know so who you're saying. I know who you're saying. Chris Pratt, Chris Helmsworth, and Chris. Uh, you oh, guys, uh, Captain right? America. Captain America. Captain America. Who is he? I can't remember his last name right <laughs> Chris. now. But, you, oh. but his autograph is like 250 US. So, um. And so it's like to pay yes. that is kind of crazy, especially for like one autograph. I understand he's Captain America, so it's okay. So that one, I'm super stoked about that. That one I'll keep. Did you um, did you see it? Did, did you, you see, see it? it? You saw it. <laughs> How crazy is that? He's so, the villain. So check that out. That's the kind of stuff you get from Autograph in the One Club every month for like twenty bucks. Like that's, that's not bad. Yeah. No, that's not bad at all. That's awesome. Yeah. So I'm very excited about that. I really enjoyed that. Uh, that package and they did a terrific job. All right. All right. Next up. Is that mine? This one's yours, yes. Yeah. Okay. This is mine. This is from Mary Costa. Mary Costa. Mary Costa is Sleeping Beauty. Aurora. Aurora. Sleeping Beauty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and in that because I sent her stuff before. Yeah, and um, she did a fantastic job of autographing all our, our stuff. Yeah, and um, so I, I thought that I would um, send her more things uh, for my aunt and my cousin because they love Disney. And when I was a little kid, my aunt would bring us to Disney all the time. So I thought this would be really cute. Um, also, my aunt and my cousin... Um, uh, what's it called? Bones? <laughs> yes. Bones and Clytus? Yes. Um, so, um, my aunt, she, uh... Works with the foundation? Works with the foundation for uh -huh. Crohn's and Colitis, because my aunt and my cousin had it before. Um, so she asked me if I can get an autograph for, like, a Disney autograph, um, to help with the foundation, like, auction it off or anything, um... Uh, so the next one's in October. They're in North Carolina. If you end up living in the area and want to go to the foundation, <laughs> uh, it's re for a really good cause. So. You want to show the pictures? Yeah. So. You still haven't showed the pictures. The I know. This entire time. So this one's for uh, the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation. 
Um, it's not personalized because it's for auctioning. <laughs> and I specified that like when I sent it to her. Um, yeah, so it says, <clears throat> Mary Costa, Princess Aurora, Sleeping Beauty 2020. And I love her handwriting. Yeah, it's so it beautiful. Great, I mean, sure. <laughs> it's like calligraphy, right? I don't know. Maybe. It's cursive. Is it cursive? <laughs> it's not calligraphy? I don't know what that I, is. Calligraphy is like super <laughs> fancy writing. Yeah, so... <clears throat> I don't think I've ever seen anybody have this nice writing as her, ever. I know. It's amazing. Like, she autographs like a princess. And she is a princess. She is a princess. Yeah. Look at that. So, yeah. Uh, this is for my cousin, uh, to Steffi, a beautiful princess from Mary Costa, Princess Aurora. And then she put on the bottom, uh, Sleeping Beauty. Yes, 2020. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this is for my cousin. And this one's for my aunt, to Sherry, a beautiful princess from Mary Costa, Princess Aurora. Boom, check that out. That's amazing. So honestly, if you guys like doing TTM, uh, Mary Cost is an amazing autograph uh, person. And she gets back to you pretty quickly. We don't wait too long for her autograph. And she's like like a princess. Like Disney one princess. Of, she's yeah, Disney right. princess. She's like, one of the only Disney princesses that sign autographs. How crazy is that? Yeah. So this one is from Bill Conte. I just sent the one Rocky poster. So... This is what it looks like. So he signed right there, and then he did uh, some music uh, notes for it. So if you don't know who Bill Conte is, uh, he does the music for Rocky. He did Rocky 1, 2, <coughs> 3, and 5. And he also did the music for Karate Kid 1 and 2, I think, maybe 3. Um, but yeah, so like Gonna Fly Now is his song, and uh, he wrote... Um, the song from Karate Kid, uh, You're the Best Around, which is a fantastic song. Oh, I like song. that song. It's amazing. And his name is right you're there. You're the best on the around. Phone. No one's ever going to get you down. Now you owe Bill Conte five bucks. Great job. <laughs> you're the best around. I would try to be. <laughs> All right. Jerry O'Connell. Who is he? I don't remember. <laughs> One, two, three times together, but that's okay. Oh. Oh, yeah, so... You got something signed for your mom. Yeah, um, so I sent it to Jerry O'Connell. If you don't know who Jerry O'Connell is, he was in Stand By Me. He's in the show Carter right now, and he's also on a Broadway play called The Soldier's Play. And so I sent it to the his play in New York. Right there. And because <laughs> I haven't seen an address for Carter, so I seen that he was signing stuff, and it's possible we might go to the Niagara Convention. It's not looking likely because all the people Kelsey wanted to see dropped out. But oh, they also Smallville. Have, they have Will Wheaton and Corey Feldman in it, and those are the other two people in Stand By Me. And that would be great to get that signed. But, yeah, so this is signed by Vern, or not Vern, Jerry O'Connell. Uh, the character this is Vern. guy? Yeah. Yeah. And that's Zoe. She messes up. Aw, my baby. And then here is the last picture, so he signed that. That's the poster of Stand By Me. Mm-hmm. If you don't know. If you don't know, you now don't know. you know. <laughs> so here's the last one. Um, so, this is from uh, Richard Stephen Horvitz, who played Alpha 5 oh, in yeah. Power Rangers. Where's your pop figure? The pop figures are in the other room, so I got him to sign an Alpha 5 pop figure. So it basically looks like that, I put Michael I, I, I and then he, he autographed it, and then he also autographed uh, Angry Beaver's Daggett in Funko Pop, which is funny because I, I like what happened was we were at Dollarama. And this, I and saw this, saw it. I saw this dag at Funko Pop, and I'm like, I wonder if this person signs, just out of the, like, I was like, whoever this person is, I have no idea who does the voice for Daggett, but I'm going to grab it regardless, because I, I kind of remember the show as a kid, and so I got it, and then I realized it was, he did sign, and he also did Alpha 5, which is like, if you know me, I loved Power Rangers as a kid, so, um, that was really cool. I should have sent him my VHS tape of, uh, what's it called, um, Power Rangers, a holiday special. I'll never watch that I don't want to take that memory. <laughs> That's probably so rough. Um, but yeah, so that was fantastic. I'll show pictures of the other two Funko Pops. I don't think you showed it to the camera. I did show it to the camera. Well, we're going to show it again. Show it again. Okay. Yeah. So, sorry guys. Um, <clears throat> we haven't gotten anything out in a while. There was like a, like a couple weeks where we just didn't get, uh, like we only got like one thing in. And so what we did was we just posted those uh, pictures of stuff on social media. So if you don't follow our uh, social media accounts... 
check them out and you can kind of see some of the weeks that are just kind of like dry where we only get like one thing because what's a sometimes it's like ah, what's the point of making a video uh so this was a big one so this was a big <laughs> one and then we shot it and then it got uh it was bad because i messed, messed up the camera up. and so i had so now we're doing a reshoot but yeah so that's all the stuff we got in um big shout out to uh autograph of the month club they that was really awesome you're uh, awesome you're awesome <laughs> um uh jerry o'connell was a fantastic surprise um i'm really glad that i got stuff from him signed bill conte i was really excited too just because rocky's one of like the best movies ever made it's not. and power rangers <laughs> is a part of my childhood and yeah disney's part of Kel's childhood yeah so it was all good all around yep um hopefully we get more stuff in next week and we can get another video to you guys uh thanks for tuning so. in Kels, anything you want to add see you later alligator like and subscribe <laughs> that too <laughs>